Hi, my name is Rina and welcome to my channel. First of all, Happy New Year! In this video, I am going to talk about my New Year's art resolutions. But first, I'll just tell you a small bit about the painting I'm doing here. I wanted to try out some of my new art supplies so you have something to look at while I talk. So I stretched some Fabriano paper and took out my new Royal and Langnickel brushes and my Mijello Mission Gold class paints and went to work. I've been dreaming about painting fruit for a long time now, especially colorful fruit. So I decided to paint an orange and a dragon fruit. I don't know why, I just... I've just had this unhealthy obsession with painting fruit for a long time now, so I just had to get it out of my system. And it was a perfect way to try out some of my new supplies. Well, over to the art resolutions for the new year. I've written down a few points here. First of all, I want to sketch more. Until now, I've usually just come up with the ideas I get on the spot when I want to make a finished piece. But I want to get better at jotting down my ideas whenever I get them and also practice drawing more from reference and from my own imagination. My goal for 2018 is to fill up six sketchbooks. Two sketchbooks mostly for just graphite work with practicing anatomy and just drawing in general. One sketchbook for practicing with my Copics. I have already started that sketchbook and I want to finish it by the end of the year. And also I want to fill three watercolor sketchbooks, as that is something that I want to practice a lot at. I am going to buy two more watercolor sketchbooks for my birthday and then I'm set for completing this goal. This means I should complete a sketchbook every two months and I think I will be able to do that. So that means some sketchbook tours through this year, I hope. Second goal is to finish one oil painting a month. This means 12 oil paintings should be done within 2018. It sounds like it's gonna be easy, but I know myself well enough to know that it's gonna be a challenge. If I end up not making an oil painting one month, I should finish two the next month, and so on. I really hope I will be able to do this because I really, really love oil painting and I really want to make a fruit painting in oils too. Third goal is to use all my mediums. I'm a little all over the place when it comes to my mediums because I I got, get these obsessions, like sometimes I only do watercolors and suddenly I'm all Copics and I don't see anything wrong with that because I'm a beginner so I don't feel like I have to stick to one thing, but uh, yeah, maybe I'll always play with all the different mediums. But I want to play more with my soft pastels, for example, and practice more with Copics and try more gouache. I feel like I have a bias towards oils and watercolors, but I really like them all, except for acrylics, maybe. I feel like I've experimented enough with them to know that they're, they're not my favorite. But yeah, practice more with all my mediums. That is a good goal. Fourth goal is to stop putting limits on myself in art. I want to be able to create without thinking too much about it. I want to tell myself more that there is no wrongs or rights in art and that I don't have to do things in a specific way. Fifth goal is to continue optimizing my art studio. Since I did my last art room tour, I've changed stuff quite drastically, but I'm still not totally happy with it. Mostly because I have so much stuff cramped into a very small room, um, and I have no idea how to store my stuff. I have some plans for my room in the near future, so I guess I'll have to make a new room tour video within the year, and also where probably going to move by the end of the spring, maybe in the summer, so things are going to be quite different. I have no idea if I even will get a whole room for myself, but I keep my fingers crossed. I really love having my own little space to just be myself and make art. 
And lastly, the sixth goal is not going to be very specific, but I want to get better at drawing anatomy and faces, but it is impossible for me to set a specific goal of how I want that to go. I guess I'll just have to look through my sketches and paintings at the end of the year and see if I've improved. So to sum it all up, here are my goals. 1. Filling 6 sketchbooks. 2. Finish 12 oil paintings. 3. Practice with all my mediums. 4. Stop limiting myself. 5. Optimize my studio. And 6. Draw better anatomy. I look forward to going through this list next year to see if I was able to keep my promises to myself. I want to have a productive year full of learning and improvement and I'm going to do my best at it. As I near the end of this video, I just want to say thank you to all my new subscribers. I had a little boom after my last art haul video and it's weird having people actually following me, but it makes me very happy. I really appreciate every sub and comment and like, it makes me want to improve even more. Thank you very much. So I wish you all a happy new year and I hope to see you next Friday. Bye!